came to Dr. Morrison's office because I was having an irregular period. I was having a lot of PMDD, struggling with depression right before I did get my period. That was already quite irregular and throwing off my mood cycle. Um, and I also was struggling a lot with gut issues, like mood related as well as just struggle like digestive wise and it was really throwing me in the ringer <laughs> on a very, very uh, frequent basis. And so it was kind of not even a choice, it was like a necessity, I think, for us to try all the possibilities that we could in order to fix these problems that I was facing on a week to week, month by month basis. Like I perform live as a singer and I play piano, right? So a lot of these issues were also causing other physical problems. They were manifesting in like, for example, I'd, I thought I had carpal tunnel for a while. Um, yeah, and so that was making work really hard. I had to get some wrist braces, but through doing some, going to see a chiropractor and sticking on the supplements, like it completely went away. And now. So we'll keep the I had tried a doctor, like a normal medicine, big pharma doctor, for some of the PMDD issues. I thought that that was mood related. And although it is, I think it mainly stems back to the gut issues. At least that is what I found now that I have been treated by Dr. Mortensen. And initially I had gone on some Xanax to try and help with the feelings of of depression that came and went fairly often. Um, but at the end of the day, it felt like a very extreme like means to an end that wasn't exactly needed. And I felt like there was a different way that I could, that I could cure it or that I could try to make it better so that I didn't have to go to drugs because I didn't, I think that those are needed sometimes, but I don't think that they were needed in my case necessarily. It was very smooth and it was very educational. My experience coming into the office actually made me excited because I was really looking forward to the diagrams that Dr. Morrison draws, especially when it came to like curing my, my regular period and mood issues around that because he drew very thorough diagrams that I ended up actually showing some of my friends because I was like, you guys should, you guys should look at this because I think a lot of women face a similar issue, maybe not to the extent that I was at the time. Um, but it was just always a very welcoming environment. And it also, although not a, an intense presence was this needed presence of you need to stay consistent on your supplements or this isn't going to work. And it's so true. <laughs> and I did fall off a few times myself, but um, the experience in the office was just really lovely and welcoming environment. I think that everything leads to the mood when you are, when your digestive system is working properly and it's on track and the gut, the leaky gut was finally healed at that point because of all of the antimicrobials and, and the prebiotic like supplements that we were doing as well as like he was making sure that I had enough of what I needed of, of the omegas and, and all of those kind of normal things that your body needs. Um, it, it just felt like everything was finally working properly. So I think I saw the biggest change with the transition from the prebiotics to the probiotics and finally getting to the strongest level of the probiotic because it feels like things that used to be really sensitive to my body, it can finally handle like it feels like stronger now and even when I do sometimes accidentally have a little bit of gluten or dairy which are things I stick away from typically I don't face as big of a reaction now mood wise and just on my skin like on the on like my in my pores and and in my mood so it's very very great and it's really changed a lot for me I would say that I understand a lot of people are hesitant to try new medical pathways because they're uncertain of the outcomes but what i would say is that this process has done more for my body and for my health and my mental state than any answers i've ever gotten from the pharmaceutical industry before and these are things that i've struggled with my whole life like my my mother found you guys so that i could 
resolve these issues, but we have been looking at things like this since I was a kid. We went to our first naturopathic doctor when we were 12 so I could get food sensitivity tests and that's when I took out gluten and dairy. So it's been a long time coming, but even with seeing other naturopathic doctors, none were able to do this process fully with me enough to get me as healthy as I am now and show me not only like the way that I can make myself healthier with and provide all the supplements and the testing to do so, but just explain and help me understand so that I'm able to repeat what the process that I went through with other people so that I can try and show them that this is going to be the best way for them to heal as well. People don't commit fully to the process until there's enough on the line and to really need to. And I would try to urge anybody who's coming to Dr. Mortensen to not wait until the symptoms get worse to realize that it's really serious to stay committed to sticking on the plan. Oh,